Hello people and welcome to another video. And yeah, I'm just uh, readjusting my seat. Because I've just sat down. Nathan is in TeamSpeak with me, but he's a bit... He's a bit busy. So where did we get to last time? Let's just have a look. Come on. Load, load, and load, and load, and load, and, and I'm asleep. <clears throat> I awake again. Oh, Nathan is now playing FSX apparently. Yeah, sorry about the lag, guys. Computer's not having a very good day. Um, what are we doing? Perform an OBD scan. Okay, sounds really simple. Really simple. Get in the car. Okay. Move this ra move the shiny thing around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Reading. It's just an id. Reading in e e pop. Oh, it's disappeared. Stand away from the door. Done. <laughs> that one was simple. Oh, click repair your column on the computer. Okay. Next order, we'll do a couple more, and then we'll, I think we'll, I think we'll, then we'll take a break. Oh, yeah. oh, end the video. Come on, thank you. Repair starter. I heard I can have my starter repaired here. It barely works, but I don't have any money for a whole new one. Can you repair it for a hundred something dollars? Something oh, a hundred US dollars. Um, yes. Mr. Password, second part one. One sec. Uh, guys, I'll be back in a second. And I'm back, guys. Sorry, I just had to speak to men quickly. Okay, repair data. Shippers. Looks like a voxel vest. Voxel insignia. I think. Oh, God, this guy's a bit mucky. This, this, I think this guy may need a couple. I think soon his whole car's going to fall apart, probably. Okay, take the starter out. Get the flip out, you stupid screw. Uh, where's repair edge? There it is. I'm repaired the starter for 93 US dollars. Gonna make a bit of profit. Don't know why I'm speaking like that, but yeah. So if you hear my mouse scrolling quite a lot, I need to turn the sensitivity up again. Uh, and swing round. Takes forever. Spin round, spinning round. And a boom. And finished. These will definitely get harder. If this is, these are really easy. It'll definitely get harder, I'll tell you that. Some of the ones that I've seen that other people have recorded, phew, I've spotted them, but it's tricky. Before my test drive, I placed all damaged parts. Shifting gears, much up. Blip off. Let's perform a test drive. Okay, it's ready to drive with keyboard. Yeah, that doesn't. Wait, it's doing sensitive. Oh yeah, I want to shut up a bit, guys, so you can see if you can hear it. When you go to shift gear, you can hear it. Yeah, you heard it there. Oh, I did. What? 
It's the Instagram. Snapchat. And boom, what an ending. And yeah, guys, if you didn't know, I'm a radio DJ. Just putting that out there. Speak about that more in the comments if you want to do. Um, okay. Let's see what's wrong with this car. Okay. Front wheel drive car. Hmm. take these wheels off because if we're going to need to take the clutch out or the clutch release bearing or st and stuff like that we'll need to take the wheels off the shock absorbers um, the drive not drive shaft the drive axles uh, then stuff yeah I think no not not shock absorbers that's at the back it, something other. I can get this out, and then I can go around this side. Uh, I should have done this be first off. this out then I can go into the bonnet if I can hit the right flipping keys for it no 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 I would have got air filter oh starter that's what I need to take out starter starter motor starter starter motor oh my god so blimmin slow Yeah, that motor. Nice green starter motor. This car must start like a blimmin' dream. And now I can take this one out. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, that's it. Clutch release bearing. Clutch release bearing's gone. Then the clutch pressure plate's fine. Then it's the clutch clutch plate. Or what I think it's called that. Oh no, friction plate. Clutch friction plate. Yep, <laughs> clutch friction plate's gone as well. Okay, let's go and buy these new components. It's a clutch release bearing. That's nice. Ah, lovely fan. Clutch release bearing and clutch pressure, clutch friction plate. Sorry, and let's clear out the broken parts. We got a clutch release bearing. Yeah, there we go. Cl and a clutch friction plate. And let's go and put this car back together, y'all. Yeah, let's go and put this car back together. And put the car back together. Put the car back together, yo. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm too high. I'm, uh, I'm a bit over the top today. And clutch friction plate. Clutch pressure plate. One, two. Three, four, oh, three, four, five. Then the clutch release bearing. Put the new one on. Then put the gearbox back on. Glitch through the main engine <laughs> stack. Okay, then I put the starter back in, and then we can close the bonnet, and then we can put the uh, drive shafts, dri not drive shaft, drive axles back in, and then put the tires back on. Click 
click, then What are you doing, Ben? Oh yeah. So if you do hear any stuff in the background. Oh yeah. Don't say it all the time, Ben, because it'll go out on YouTube. The shit. <laughs> are you looking for H1? I am um, indeed. There's H1. Where's the fucking wire? What do you want the? Why do you want the wire? Can't plug it into the computer. Oh yeah, <laughs> I forgot. Okay, I'm gonna speak over. I'm gonna speak really loud over the music, so I don't get copyright, but so Ben can listen to it. But yeah, um, Ben's just gonna go off and record with the H1. If you don't know what H1 is, search it on eBay or Amazon or your 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 shopping site. Wherever you, wherever do you, you shop, just sh search H1. I think. Put this tire back on. <laughs> and put back on. Are we done? Yep. Okay, guys. Let's let's gonna take it. Let's take a sneak peek at what's coming up in the next video. What what's Ooh, what what's gonna be coming up in the next video? What's the next one we doing? Ooh. Replace car battery and check altimeter. Al altimeter. Al alternator. I'm stupid. Okay, that's what that's what's gonna be happening in the next. That's the first one in the next video, guys. So see you in the next one. Adios. I will get back into Car Mechanic Simulator, um, but what is it? Series, there we go. Oh, flip! Lights! Oh, fuck, I turned them all off. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I pressed the wrong button, I switched all of them off. Um, but yeah, I'll be getting back into Car Mechanic Simulator series soon. Um, 